Welcome to Job Form. My name is George, and today I'm going to show you how to capitalize some or all notification fields on the email. This is really useful when you want to make sure that the first letter of a word is capitalized. When users type in the name and they use all the word as lowercase, well, it's going to capitalize the first letter of that word on the email notification. So I'm going to show you how to accomplish this right now. Okay, this is the job form dashboard. Let's get started by creating a brand new form. So let's go into create a form. We're going to start from scratch. We're going to select classic form. And we're going to drag in the elements that we might need for our form. Let's go to the left, add form elements. And we're going to say, for example, let's add the name, the phone number. Let's add some short text, some long text, and the email field. So let's add that email right here. And we're going to say, for example, this short text is a question. For example, do you like dot form? Okay, it's going to be a simple question. More comments here. Okay, so we have the name field, the phone, a question, and a text box, large, long text, the email, and we're good to go. Now, how do we actually make sure that the first letter of a word is capitalized? Well, let's go into settings, go to email, let's go into the notification email. And what we have to do to make sure that the first letter of the word is capitalized, we're going to add this variable right here. Capitalize. Okay. This is going to make sure that this field, it's going to capitalize the first letter of the word. So let's go ahead and save this. Let's go test it out open in a new tab and let's type in the name. Remember, I am typing the name in lower case. So none of these are capitalized. Random phone number. Do you like job form? Oops. Like job form? Yes, I do. More comments. No email. Let's go ahead and submit it. Okay. Now it's been submitted. Let's go check out that email. Okay. This is the email we've just received. You can see here that the first letter is capitalized from these two words, which is the name field. Now, what happens if we capitalize the letter on another type of field? Let me show you what could happen because you might not want to use it or you may want to. So for example, let's go into settings, go to emails, again, notification, and we're going to add the same code right here, for example, in the more comments. Okay. And even here, do you like job form? Let's add it here also. Let's go ahead and save it. Let's go into publish, open a new tab. And again, I'm going to type everything in lowercase. So again, my name, random phone number, um, cap, uh, lowercase here and pay really good attention here of what's going to happen if you add that code right here. So for example, I don't have more comments. Okay. So we have one, two, three, four, five words here. Okay. So remember, it's going to capitalize each of the first letters of each of these words. So we have to make sure that this is something that we want or not when we receive the email. Let's go check out that email so you can check out what I'm talking about. Okay, here's the email that we've just received. Again, the name has the first letter of the word capitalized and check out what happened here in the comments. So each one of these words has the first letter capitalized. So just to make sure that if you need this, you can add the code there. But if you don't want to have each of these words with the first letter capitalized, don't use that code in the notification email. And if you like to add the same code to the other email where the autoresponder email, which the user is going to receive, you can do the same by adding the code here, saving, and the autoresponder email is also going to do the same. It's going to capitalize the first letter of the word. Well, that is how you capitalize the first letter of the word on Jotform. We thank you all for watching and we'll see you on our next tutorials.